Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name's Danielle. Subscribe down below. Today I'm so excited to be coming at you guys with another favorites video because September favorites went really well and you guys said you wanted more each month. So I can't believe September's already over. Like went by in a blink of an eye and now I'm 20. Wild. I turned 20 on September 20th. Golden birthday. Woo -woo. Anyways, October is now over. Like Halloween has happened. Like this is just so weird. I'm thinking of like decorating my apartment for Christmas like tomorrow because I go home for Thanksgiving break and then I come back and I'm here for like three weeks and I go home for Christmas break. So, you know, I might just decorate early. Isn't it like a thing? Anyways, tangent. Today I am so excited because I have so many products I want to talk to you guys about. I don't know why. Actually, I know why. I've just been finding some great things. I'm just going to be standing up. I'm into standing up in my videos lately because I just have more energy and I just want to like stand. Sitting down just makes me so anxious. I'm like, oh my god. I've got lifestyle favorites. I've got some hair stuff, some makeup, few pairs of shoes. I don't have like a ton of favorites, but the favorites I have picked out are like really important. I've been using them every day and I just really want to talk to you guys about them. Anyways, I'll have all the products that I talk about linked down below as well. Follow me on Instagram at Danielle Carolyn. I've been having so much fun taking all these fun fall photos. The foliage is so pretty. I'm like looking at the trees right now. It's so nice. But yeah, without further ado, let's get started with this favorites video. The first thing I want to talk about is this leopard scrunchie right here. I got this from a store called Lily Rain in Atlanta at the Pont City Market. But I believe this store is a chain. They have an online website, but they like don't have a ton on their website. But I'm sure you could just look up like leopard scrunchie. This one is like oversized and obnoxious. If you would have asked me last year, like I would have told you I hate leopard. Like I legit hated leopard, cheetah, all that. And leopard is in this fall and I'm not mad about it because all of a sudden I've gotten really into it. I'm you can't see, but I'm wearing like this like leopard skirt. You guys literally can't see. Oh, there it is. <laughs> flashing you guys, but you can't see, huh? When Kenzie was here, I took her to the store and she bought one because she's always loved leopards, so she needed this, obviously. Um, I think I'm just gonna keep this on my wrist for the rest of the video because it just like adds something. Or does it? Is that weird? I don't know. I'll take it off just to not distract. I'll put a link down below to a similar one or if I find the exact one, I don't know, I'll find it. Um, but I really just like this and it's a great staple and it just looks super cute in your hair as well, obviously. <laughs> if you guys have been watching YouTube for like years, you might recognize this product. This is the Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. I'm talking like days of like, I'm talking like the days of Juicy Star 07 and all that, like everyone used this. This is a hair mask and I used to use it all the time. I would make my hair so soft and I just stopped and no one really talks about it on YouTube anymore. I don't know why, cause it's like an OG thing or whatever. But I just saw this at CVS the other day and I was like, oh my gosh, I used to use that all the time. And I really have been having trouble finding a good hair mask cause like when I, I get my hair colored obviously and so it makes my hair drier and I wanna color my hair. So you know, gotta figure out something. So this has been an amazing mask. It smells so good. They also have a great heat protectant. I love this brand, Macadamia. It is so great. I just put it on the ends of my hair because if I put it at my roots, my hair would just get too greasy. Um, but I just put it at the ends of my hair while I'm showering so while like, I'm shaving my legs and washing my face and my body and all that fun stuff. Rinse it out and my hair is super soft and it feels amazing, so love it. When fall and the holidays kind of come around, I really enjoy wearing lip products and in specific like colored lips, in specific red lips. Um, it's, it's, it's a hard one to pull off and I don't know if I can, but when I get the chance, I do love to wear a red lip and it's so exciting and it just feels so festive. So this is the Artistry Studio NYC Edition 2-in-1 Lipstick. This is a great lip product. I love it. I have a few different colors. So on one side, it's got like you know, like a normal, that's not really normal lipstick. It's more of like a thick lip liner. And I love this because it's so easy to apply because I'll like line my lips with it first, then fill it in. And then on the other side, this is like, I think it's called like a lip powder. So this side they call the lip crayon and this side they call the lip powder. And this is what I wear. I wore this in my Q&A video, I think. I didn't put the lip crayon on. I just used this and just kind of powdered it around my lips. And it's more of like a muted red, so it's not as crazy. Um, so I really like this. I've been taking this on all my trips with me. It's just a great all-in-one product, so I'll have it linked down below. Guys, this stuff smells amazing. This is the Taka. Oh gosh, triggered. Maybe Toka. I don't really know. T-O-C-C-A. Hair fragrance. I got this at Anthropology. I never really buy anything from Anthropology. It's really weird. At least clothing wise. I don't know why. It's not necessarily my style. But I love going into Anthropology. One, to smell their Capri Blue candles because the whole store is smelled like it. And I love looking at all the little trinkets and their home decor. I do buy a lot of their home stuff. But anyways, I was just sniffing around and I found this. And this is in the, co the color. This is in the scent Florence. And it smells like jasmine and all this amazingness. 
Mm. And I sprayed it out in my eye. I sprayed it all over and in my hair. It's technically a hair fragrance, but the reason hair fragrances are so great is because fragrance really sticks to your hair. So like when you like go like this to be like, oh what? People will smell it and it smells really good. Um, so I bought this because I didn't even know there was a perfume the other day I was at Anthropology and they do have a perfume version of this if you would rather a perfume. But this just smells amazing. It's very fresh. It just smells like jasmine and goodness. It's just like I want to smell like this all the time. So I might have to buy the perfume as well. But go to Anthropology, smell it, or just take my word for it and buy it. Link down below. <laughs> Another favorite of mine are my lashes. And if you guys have been following me for like the past few years, you know I used to have eyelash extensions and I was obsessed with them. I literally got them once to just try out and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm in love. And I just kept getting them. And then I started to get annoyed with them because I always had to get them refilled and like it was just getting, I hated washing my face with my lash extensions on and my eyes were like just not liking them. So this past summer I got them taken off and my lashes were so short, like legit I felt like a gerbil. I don't know why I called myself a gerbil, I just felt like a gerbil. That's the only way I could describe myself, it was bad. And, but I hate wearing mascara. So then for like a few months during the summer I used Babe Lash, which is like a serum and it really grew out my lashes. And I was wearing mascara, whatever, and I just hate wearing mascara because my eyes are so small and the um, mascara transfers to my lower lashes and then transfers and then it's just smudge all over. I tried waterproof mascara. Waterproof mascara works pretty well. It like was better, but I just don't like wearing mascara. Like I just don't like it. So I just recently, that's a long story, I just recently got a lash lift and tint. I'll show a close up, but you guys, I went to this girl in Athens. If you guys live in Athens or you go to UGA, go to Carly McGuffrey. She is amazing. She's five minutes down the road from campus. Basically what it is, a lash lift, this is, these are my natural lashes. I'm not wearing mascara, but don't I look so awake right now? Doesn't it look like I have mascara on? So my lashes are naturally dark and pretty long, but you know, I wanted them enhanced. So I got this lash lift and I was in there for like 45 minutes. Basically it's like a keratin treatment for your eyelashes and then the tint is extra. So if you're gonna do one or the other, I would definitely do the lash lift because it's just more powerful. It's supposed to last four to eight weeks. And then I also had her tint them. So it just keeps them a little darker. I have some friends that are blonde and they have like blonde lashes. So they just did the tint and it made all the more difference for them. So it's like whatever you want. But yeah, I'm so happy. I've gotten so many compliments. Like seriously, I, I haven't worn mascara since I've gotten it. And I'm gonna probably keep going and get these lifts just because they're just so ideal. And I just, I'm so happy I found out about these. So yeah, I'll have Carly's Instagram link down below if you guys live in the area and you want to go to her but seriously get a lash lift it's amazing I'm just so happy I'm a gold jewelry gal I like wearing gold jewelry I just think silver doesn't look great on me today I'm just wearing these like little star earrings but I'm really into gold hoops I've told you guys this in the past these are the gold hoops I've been wearing a lot I don't really wear these to class I just wear these to class because they're just a little bit more chill um, but I love these earrings right now I've been wearing my hair in a half up half down a lot with like a cute sweater and these earrings and it just looks so great like these are awesome gold thick hoop earrings but they're small and they're just so cute these are from Argenti Argent Vivo US or something I'll have their Instagram link down below on their website um, but yeah they have a ton of really cute gold jewelry I kind of want to make a video talking about all my favorite gold jewelry is that weird like rings and stuff I don't know also on the note of jewelry I'm wearing my girl Hannah Malosh's ring she she just sent me um, all the products from her like moon collection so I got earrings, um, a necklace, and this ring and it's a moon and it's so cute and I'm so proud of her. She had the wave collection and now she came out with the moon uh, collection and it's so cute. I love this little gold ring. This is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder and this is the, in the color Dim Light. My girl Kenzie has talked about this a lot. Brooks used it, Molly's used it, a lot of my friends have used this and I just didn't understand it. Um, but basically it's like a lighting powder. So it's not like a highlight just for right here. Um, Kenzie said after she puts on her It Cosmetics CC Cream, she just puts this all over her face and it seriously does give you this glow. I like just did my makeup because I didn't have makeup on today so I just put on makeup for this video. And I put it on all over my face and like keep in mind this is not from that powder, this is from my poor bronzing. That's embarrassing, oh my god. But this powder is amazing. Like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but my skin just has this glow to it, and it's not really because of the bronzer, it's because of this. Like, it just enhances your skin, and I'm just obsessed with it. I have to say thank you to all of you guys that recommended I try the Tarte Shape Tape um, Concealer. I've been breaking out lately, and it's really sad, and I've been trying to just let my skin breathe, but when I do wear makeup, I wanted a good concealer that stuck to my skin and just stayed and just covered up the pimples. That sounded gross. That was a gross 
gross end. You guys recommended the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and my assistant Callie had it and wasn't using it so she gave it to me which is so sweet, thank you Callie. Um, but I love it, I love it a lot. I heard they have a foundation version of it. I don't think I'll try it because it's super thick. It's a very thick concealer for sure. Like I wouldn't put it under my eyes, I just put it on my blemishes but it sticks, it doesn't slide all over your skin. Love it, here for it. And lastly, I have two pairs of shoes that I want to show you guys that I've been wearing a lot. First up are these bad boys. I finally got on the Air Force One train from Nike. I got these off of Revolve though, so I'll have them linked down below. I really like these sneakers. These are the Nike Air Force Ones. Everyone and their mother has them. I like them because they're platform. Any sort of platform sneaker I'm all about because I like just feeling taller. I think platform sneakers are just flattering in general too. I don't know why. Um, but so yeah, I just got these. I wore them today. Actually, that's why they're like still tied. I just slipped them off my feet. But I really like them. I don't really have much to say other than they're just like a nice clean shoe and they look great with a lot of different outfits. The second pair of shoes I have are these Mark Fisher booties. I absolutely love them. I talked about them in my cold weather essentials video. Um, I'm all about a pointed boot. Again, they're just super flattering. These have like the perfect amount of heel where you can walk in them all day and not want to like cry. Um, so they're really, really comfortable. They're from Mark Fisher, but I got them at Nordstrom. Um, so they're great. I'll have a link down below. They're not super expensive and they're just like a perfect quality. They're just so soft. They're so comfortable. They zip in this inside of it. They zip, so easy to put on. They just look so great and they're so flattering. Did I say that already? And lastly, I have to do a little plug for Gals on the Go podcast. My best friend Brooke and I started our own podcast a couple months ago and it's been doing really well. Like it's crazy. Like I'm just so thankful. We upload podcasts every Wednesday on Spotify and iTunes or Apple um, and we've just been having so much fun. Seriously, we do episodes about our fall essentials where we did one on self-care. We've had a couple guests. We had Kenzie on one. We had Morgan on an episode. Um, and we're just having so much fun and we've just got such great feedback. I love podcasts because I can just put them in my ear pods. Ear pods. I love podcasts because I can clean my apartment while I'm listening to one and I don't have to worry about looking at the TV or if I'm walking to class I feel like I'm learning something new or I'm getting just some good entertainment while I'm driving is a big one because I've been driving back and forth to Atlanta a lot so it's just really nice and Gals on the Go is like our new little baby and we just changed the cover art. Um, we have this amazing designer Emma. She's awesome. Thank you Emma. And so here's the little cover art right here. I'm obsessed with it. I'm so happy. I'm so grateful. And yeah, so if you guys want to follow us there, we post new episodes every Wednesday. And also feel free to follow at Gals on the Go podcast on Instagram to be featured in any of our Q&As in each episode and just kind of to get daily inspo. We did it! That is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love filming favorites videos. Oh, they make me so happy. I love you guys so much. I will have all the items that I talked about linked down below for you guys. And I'll see you guys very soon for our next video. Bye!